Template Monster presents. Hey there. People often ask me, how do I choose a WordPress theme? That is a great question, but uh, first things first. Uh, before getting to the WordPress theme, let's first talk about what WordPress engine itself uh, would be. Uh, think of WordPress as a skeleton in a human body, marked here in black. Uh, in this case, the WordPress theme would be the muscles uh, and the skin uh, in a human, which uh, kind of grows on top of the skeleton, which holds our guts together and basically makes us who we are. Uh, that's how people can tell each other from, you know, from each other. Um, and um, uh, I know it's a very rough example, but uh, the point is, just like in the human body, uh, the, the, the WordPress engine and the WordPress theme cannot exist without each other. Um, and um, the next point is that uh, there's a lot of places and providers that you can acquire WordPress themes from. Uh, there are premium WordPress themes that you should pay for and there are free WordPress themes. Uh, there's thousands and thousands of them on the internet, uh, but uh, I personally would not recommend you to work with the free WordPress themes because they're uh, sort of unstable. Uh, the providers do not uh, offer support for, for these themes uh, and uh, that's why you know, the professionals do not often use the WordPress themes uh, that are uh, that have been downloaded for free. Uh, as for the premium themes, the market is huge. I mean, it's uh, it's really enormous. There are uh, hundreds of, of providers who sell uh, the paid WordPress themes. Uh, there are Template Monster, Theme Forest, uh, Elegant Themes, Rocket Theme, and a lot of, of the smaller ones. Uh, the biggest providers on the market would be Template Monster and ThemeForest. Uh, ThemeForest is a company which is basically a marketplace. Uh, it is the, the website that independent WordPress themes providers uh, and producers uh, come to and sell the products from. So basically uh, ThemeForest does not provide any products from themselves. Uh, they just sell it on behalf of, of the sellers. Uh, as for the, the Template Monster, it's, uh, it's what you call a full cycle company. Uh, they produce their own WordPress themes. Uh, they have their in-house team of designers, uh, developers, a support team who, who are trained to work with, uh, uh, with support issues, the billing team, and, uh, and so on. So basically this means uh, for you, like an end user. This means that uh, Template Monster uh, provides a sort of a greater extent of control over the quality of the product. Uh, they provide their own support and uh, they sort of bear responsibility for what they sell. Uh, whereas uh, uh, ThemeForest reserve the right not to provide the support uh, for, uh, for their themes. And um, uh, it's actually the, the, their official position uh, and uh, but if you are a professional developer, uh, you may get lucky and uh, and you may acquire a perfect uh, WordPress theme, uh, which is professionally done and which is very individual, which is um, of high quality. Uh, but you have to know where to look for on ThemeForest. And uh, that actually that's actually it for for this episode. If you have any questions about uh, choosing the WordPress theme on the internet, please feel free to ask them in the comments section. I'll be happy to answer. Uh, see you next time. Bye-bye. Do you want to get an answer to any question regarding webmastering and getting your business online? Visit templatemonster.com startup hub to learn how you can bring your ideas to life.